Hello everyone, welcome to Next and AI Academy. In this video, we are going to learn about Java comments. From now, let's try to follow a different approach of learning. That is, rather than seeing the theory slides, let's try to learn each topic with practical implementation. Because all the interview questions are based on two things, why and how. Let's move into the practical area. In the previous video, we have created Java project, then package followed by Java class. And this class is used to display the greeting message. That is, when we run this, you will get welcome to Java class. Just think, if a non-technical user see this program, definitely he will not understand what this means. So, now comes the importance of Java comments. Okay, I want to include some additional information in this program which describes about some functionality or entire program. How to do that? For example, if I type any words here, what will happen is you will get some error message. It means we can't type directly any information. So, we have to implement the Java comments. The Java comments are single line comments, another one is multi line comments. First, let me implement the single line comments. The single line comments will be implemented by to forward slash, then you can type here any message. This is a single line comments. Here, we can type any message like it is used to print an argument passed to it. So by reading this, any non-technical user can able to understand this particular line is used to print the output. This is single line command. Just you have to include forward double slash. Then the next one is multi-line commands. For example, now we want to enter a very big description. Then Single line comments will not be helpful. We have to go for multi line comments. Syntax for that is forward slash star, and if you press enter, this is the multi line command. So you can put any number of enter. See, you can see it will be in green color. This is the multi line comments. Now I can type any number of line, for example, this program is used to print greeting message. You can see I am just pressing enter automatically this is increasing. If you want to pass just a single line information to the user then you can use single line commands. If you want to enter more data then it is a multi line commands is the best solution. And uh, one of the main advantage of using Java comments is readability. So any person who view this program will be easier to understand. That. Now let me show few example how we can use these multi-line comments. We'll be learning about instance variables in future and this is one example like declaration, what it is used for, what is its default value like that additional information we can give it in the multi-line comments and then using single line commands i can tell this is an employer details then we have to create the instance of object so very important information we can give it one more example this is called blocked command almost in all the automation project if you open any file you will be seeing like this this gives a very clear picture about this program for example author who did the project name what is the purpose of this particular program like this program is used to register for automation demo when created and this is very important like review comments so 2016 created and 2017 it was updated by user one then in 2020 by another user like this whatever modification we are making here that will be logged here this is a very useful feature we are having it in the java the biggest use of this is program readability 
or code readability and second usage is let me go to this program again for example I just added two more print command that is welcome to selenium class and test ng class if we execute this program of course we will get three lines now I don't want to execute a particular line rather than deleting like this what we can do is we can include double forward slash this is another indirect use of java comments just commenting that particular line now if i execute this program see the output only welcome to java class and test ng is displayed the selenium is not displayed the middle line is not displayed this is an another use of java comments here it is just a single line for example you have almost some 10 or 20 lines needs to be commented it's not a good practice to include double forward slash in front of all the lines rather than we can implement multi-line commands just forward slash star star forward slash if you include like this then this full statement or full piece of code will be commented so that while executing this particular line of code will not be executed even though this is a very simplest feature in java but we use this widely across all the program and especially in automation while doing the code reviews the first checklist is whether the developer is implemented java comments or not hope you got a clear picture about java comments that's the end of this video thanks for watching have a good day